Hi, Phil Claudio again with another Star Power interview with one of the top professionals within the Kai's company, Mr. Stan Rosen. Stan and I first met, I believe, in 2001. You were Rookie of the Year. How did you do that, Stan? Yeah, right here in the city of Weston, Phil. Um, 2001, uh, right when I started the business, I, I took charge of my sales ability. Um, I used good time management. I took a good training sessions. I learned by the best in the industry and whatever I didn't like, what I was trained or taught by the individuals in the company, I took it and put it in my own ways. That's probably the best thing to do. You know, when you first started out, technology was just coming into its own back in the, uh, the early 2000s. And I know today it's one of the major parts of your, your career. Can you tell us a little bit about what you're doing? Yes. Being a marketing major and a graduate from Florida International University, um, marketing myself was the biggest thing. I wanted to brand myself. I knew I came within the Kais company, which had 78 plus years back then, and now it's 80 plus years. And I wanted to brand my name and create a synergy between Stanley Rosen and the Kais company. So what I did is I did all types of advertising, mailings, billboards with my name on it right. and cable <clears throat> ads and now it's all about stanleyrosen.com branding me very good know you know i was in your office the other day and i noticed that you have uh, it's kind of like i guess it's like a, an excel spreadsheet that's sitting on the wall and usually i'll ask somebody about their business plan and you think of a business plan as okay how many do i have to do this year your business plan is unique I mean, it shows exactly what you need to do every single day, almost, down to the... Yes, it's, um, right now, the group, uh, you could say we have about 14 to 16 closings a month, mm -hmm. okay, in, in units, and it's like saying a closing every other day, and working very hard and approaching the half a billion dollar mark in such a short time period, you know, with hard work and a great surrounding group of business partners. Like I tell my business partners every day, you don't work for me, you work with me. You know, we're one unit and that's who makes me who I am. Not just Stanley Rosen, but my group as well. Stan, when he first started out, I remember distinctly him saying that, uh, I want, he didn't really say it, these words, but he said, I want to prove that I can do this on my own. And in the first year, he did it on his own. But then you formed a team. How, how did you do that? When did you first realize you needed that team? In, in fact, what I'm really asking is how did you know based on your personal life and based on your business life when it was necessary to have a team working with you? Well, um, <clears throat> doing 30 to 40 million and uh, getting home at the end of the night and finding out that I'm all by myself at 42 million, at 43 million a year in 2003 and 2004 it was it was just too much pressure, too much to do on my own, and I decided that I needed a balance. And the most important thing for me was not to be a great realtor and a good father, but to be a great father and a great realtor. Very so good. balance to me right now is the most important thing. I don't have a team to be better than anybody. I have a team so that we can spread our growth and at the same time, we each and all of us have a balance in our lives. Very good. I was uh, talking to Stan earlier about the team and not necessarily what they make, but this percentage of split between he and his team. And I'm not going to go into that, but right. I, was, I was amazed that what he gives to his team and what they give back to him. You know, let me ask you one final question. And that is, what would you give to, or what would you advise to somebody that would like to emulate your success, would like to arrive at the period and career in real estate as you are now? Well, right now we're in a different time and <clears throat> the economy's in a different situation. Um, something that's very important is for you to focus on time management. Try to stay away from watching too much TV, uh, listening too much of public radio, reading too much of the newspaper. I wake up in the morning, I take a shower, put on some good music, and at the same time, I take my mind to the level of production within myself, not with what's going on in the world. And if people can apply themselves in a positive manner and worry on doing positive things, everything else will carry 
forward. Now, today, uh, people confront me and, and ask me, Stan, what are you doing? And I say, I'm in real estate. Is that really working for you? I go, well, it works if you work. And the synergy that I have developed with the Kais company, uh, Michael Pappas, and the whole staff, the whole organization has been incredible as putting me in the position that I am today. If I didn't have the tools, the backing, the support, the image, and the class of organization that the Kais company is, Stanley Rosen wouldn't be developing the way he has developed because I came into this business with no idea about real estate. It was pure come in, learn, and execute. Learn and execute. There'll be things you like, there won't be things you don't like. Just think of the positives, and that's my mind every day. You know, uh, this is all about doing the right thing within my group, branding my name, which is very important because Kai's is a hell of a brand. And StanleyRosen.com, I want to work within that brand myself and continue to build my real estate business to higher levels. Right. Because I remember when you said, Stan, where do you see yourself down the line within the Kai's company? <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> and I told you I wanted to be king. And it's funny that it's not about being a king. It's just being good at what you do. Very good. Share it with others, grow with others, proceed and succeed with others. Very good. My mindset, it's very important. I'm a very spiritual individual. I believe 50% of the battle every day is to get up out of bed. If the man upstairs gets you out of bed, you're in good shape. The other 50% of the time is what you're going to do with it. How you're going to apply your efforts and your professionalism to your occupation. And remember, if you work, it works. Nobody's going to do it for you. But at least you have a great real estate company like the Kai's company. No good. Nobody could have said it better. Thank you. Thank you, Stan. I'd like to, because uh, I know Chef Stan will say this, but uh, Stan's farm is not just Western. It's, <laughs> it's all of South Florida. I've seen Stan go down to Homestead to take leads. I've seen him go up to Palm Beach Gardens to take a, a lead with another associate in the company. And one of the things that's really interesting about Stan is that he works with every associate in this company. His farm is basically not only a geographic farm, but also a farm of other associates. If you need something, call Stan Rosen. He can really help you. He is a class act. Thank yeah. you, Stan. I appreciate it very much.